good morning, good afternoon, good evening, whatever. Um, I just got up a little while ago. I've had a little bit of coffee, but um, I was really moved to um, just come on and say hi. Uh, you know, when I originally started my Awakening 101, it was... Um, I wanted to come on here daily. That's what I was doing. I was, I was talking daily and I was, and, um, anyway, I've just kind of been inspired to do that as well. I'm still going to do like my card readings and everything, but I just like have really been being moved to, um, share more of myself, you know, and connect more with the people that, um, like what I had originally wanted to do, which is like, you know, share my story and help so that it doesn't seem at, sorry, I didn't turn my phone off. People are texting me. And, um, because, you know, waking up, you know, whatever, um, you know, for me, it's, it's been about, you know, realizing that what's going on isn't just what's going on, you know, like there's like a whole lot going on out in the universe and it's really changed my life and it's really uh that's why I do the tarot cards too because um you know a long story short but I found my way to tarot cards and then um you know it helped guide me through my um an even even deeper spiritual understanding of myself and my connection with I I, I just call him God, whoever you relate to, universe, source, whatever. Um, I use all the words, but mostly I just talk to God, you know. But um, anyway, so this morning I just feel, okay, this is telling me to exercise and that's what I'm about to do after this. So, <laughs> but, um, you know, I just feel um, moved to come on and just, talk and share and just inspired because, and even in the message that I got from my um, Instagram, I shared it on Instagram. It was a song that came to me and I've never listened to that song before, um, but I, you know, before today, but it's a, a print song. She's always in my hair. So because it came up in this, you know, it might be for somebody that's listening to this as well. So anyway, but um, it's just, it's like owning who you are, um, and feeling comfortable with who you are, you know, like before, you know, there's tons of people on YouTube and on Instagram and they all, you know, they, they're speakers and motivators and call themselves whatever. And, and that's awesome, you know, and they're doing great and they're inspiring people all over. And, um, you know, I know that, I'm just, I'm just like me, you know, like, like I know that I have, um, I want to connect with people and I know that I've, uh, experienced my life the way that I've experienced my life because I'm supposed to share my story, you know, and, And hopes to inspire you to be, like, it's not because like, I feel like I know anything or because I feel like, oh yeah, you should listen to me. You know, it's like proof. I am living proof, like right here in front of you that I just started hearing that song loser like me. <laughs> um, it's a glee song, uh, but it's all about you know, I'm, I'm just, I'm just me and I have made a billion mistakes. And if I can do this, I promise you, it means that anybody can change their life because <laughs> the more I stay on my path and the deeper that I go into my healing and my understanding of myself, the more <laughs> I realized like when I thought I knew so much, like I never really knew anything at all, you know? And I don't know. I just, it cracks me up now, you know, when, but 
don't know. I don't know what. Uh, see, look, try something new. I've been getting this this card for three days. Um. Anyway, I'm gonna pick a card for us, and, and we'll see where what we're supposed to talk about. Where? There we go. You saw that. Simplicity. Put your energy into the basics and let go of excess. Yeah. It's just, it's about, it's still about what I was like saying. It's like, just be real, be true to you, to, to who, who we are. It's like all the other stuff. It's like, you can like put all, all your energy into, I, okay. I'm, I like to keep things on me because I don't like to, to, tell you how you're thinking. I'm, I don't like people, to, you know, assuming they know how I think, you know, I don't know. So I know that I have at times um, put all my energy, it says put your energy into the basics and let go of access. So basics for me, um, like meditating, because <laughs> if I don't, <laughs> my whole day goes off and like that that started off meditating for me it started off like literally I, I put the timer on for 30 seconds you know because I was just sitting still and being quiet for like 30 seconds was like a big deal so and then I went to a minute and then I went to a minute and a half you know so um and now I can there's never enough time you know <laughs> to like I could stay out there all day you know, and, but, um, cause for me, I meditate outside. So, but, um, exercise, it's the things it's like eating, right. That's what I'm feeling like. It's like those basics, like, because it's preparing us for, um, the day, you know, and, for where we're headed, like getting into a routine of taking care of the basics, you know, like um, the things that energize us, because I feel like I know I feel in my own personal life. And normally I know that when I'm going through something that there's other people going through the same thing and feeling the same way. At least that's what my experience has shown me through, um, you know, connecting, starting this YouTube channel and my Instagram and connecting with different people and just the feedback I've gotten from you guys is that I'm not, when I'm going through something and feeling a certain way, like I'm not the only one. So, um, because I personally feel like my life is about to freaking blast off, like onto a whole nother level that I like, like that I almost don't even believe can really happen, but I feel like it's going to happen, you know, and I don't know what that means, you know, <laughs> but I know that, um, I still have to stay in my day, you know, practice staying in the moment. And I mean, that's like a saving grace for me is that look down at my feet. I say it all the time, look down at my feet. Um, because that reminds me where I am. And that's what I do when I get overwhelmed. And that's what I feel like this is about. It's like, keep it simple, stupid, you know, um, being in the moment, but, but what, let me go back to this. Cause this is a bit, this is, this is seriously something that I learned many years ago when I first got sober. Cause I'm, I'm about, I'm like 17 and a half years sober now, but, um, in my first year of sobriety, uh, my sponsor, uh, I was like, always like freaking out. I was like a hyper spastic person, you know, um, when I first got sober and, um, you know, she used to tell me to look down at my feet and I was like, what, you know, but cause you look down at your feet and you're reminded where you are. Like I'm looking down at my feet right now and here I am, I'm sitting in this chair talking to, um, all you on YouTube and, um, and she's saying, and then you take a deep breath look up and do what's in front of you. Because like this moment right now, like where I'm at right now, like this is the only moment th that matters. And, and so it did not happen overnight. Like I told you, I, I learned this, um, over 17 years ago. Okay. So it's been something that I've practiced, um, throughout my whole 
since that day that she told me. And, um, I've had to repeat it, you know, 50, 60, a hundred times in a day. I've had to like call her and be like, what was that thing again? Or I'd call her in a world and she'd be like, have you looked down at your feet yet? I'd be like, Oh no, I forgot to do that. You know? And so I'd hang up and I, I do that. And, um, it's literally practice, but that's what I feel. It's like keeping it super freaking simple, you know? And, um, because I feel like a lot of people are going to have some major freaking shifts in their life soon for the better. Like, I feel like it's for the better. And maybe for some, it might not look like it's for the better at first, but it's, but it, as it unravels, it'll be, um, amazing. Like, I just feel like amazing things are coming and, um, but they're already here. Like really the good stuff is happening right now, you know, feeling good is right now. And, and that's like the practice for it. Yeah. Gratitude. I'm like, now I'm brought back to the gratitude and that's like gratitude for the moment. <sighs> like taking it down a notch, you know, feeling the energy. Cause I don't know if anybody else can feel it, but I can feel, I can feel it come in. And, um, like taking it down, being back in, you know, today in the right now. So anyway, I guess that's it. Um, I just looked at the clock. It was 1133. And, um, so I'm going to like end it there, but I really love you guys. And I hope that, um, you have an amazing day and just remember, keep it simple. And when you start to get overwhelmed and frustrated with your life, look down at your feet to remind you where you are. Take a deep breath, look up and do what's in front of you to do. And that's it. Don't think about what you got to do in an hour. Don't even think about what you got to do in a week. Like none of it. Like just do what's in front of you to do. I love you. Have a great day. Bye.